Okay, hello Autumn. Making this little tutorial video for you. Hopefully it makes sense because to be honest I have not used Gimp in a really long time. Oh my god, I can't even control it. There we go. Anyway. So you wanna learn how to make a little furry line thing, so hopefully I can help you out. So first of all, you want it to be the smallest that it could possibly be. And it's set automatically at one, which looks something like that. That's one. I think that's the automatic setting. And look, who does little cool lines? Um, but you want it to be at like point zero one. That's super tiny. Super tiny. Okay, so I just picked a random picture just so I could do it. Um. It, okay, so after you scale your brushes down, and actually you wanna, it's, I just downloaded this, so this is what everything was already set on. You also wanna pick a, fl a furry brush. So I, they're kind of all the same, it looks like, so. It's called Circle Fuzzy, zero three. And that'll be kinda like this. Well, maybe not, you can't even see it, where's the fuzzy? Maybe that's too fuzzy. Take a little bigger fuzzy. Uh, you can kind of see it. That's not very good though. I have a big fuzzy one. It's a little better. You get the point. Um. Okay. Well, once you've got, maybe I can make it scale it up just a little bit to make it a little more visible. Cause it's almost too small. That looks a little better. So you can just mess with it. Just don't make it huge, otherwise it just it, otherwise it'll look kinda weird. Okay, so the next thing you want to do is ignore the screaming in the background. Make a new layer because if you mess up make a new layer. Because if you mess up then Oh, hold on a second, let me fix this. Can I merge it down now? Yay! Okay. Because if you mess up, you can just go to the eraser tool and erase it, and it won't erase the background, assumedly. Um, so, um, okay, zoom doesn't work the same either. So, of course not. Though. So, you want to zoom in enough, well, that might have been too much, well, so you can see the outlines of the face. And and don't go crazy. A little little works, you know. So you just kind of do it, and just do it. And in this case, the wolf already kind of has fleshy fur. And also, I'm using a tablet, so if you use it without a tablet, it will be something. That, oopsies, that's not that's not what I wanted. Oh my god zoom out. I forgot that I was not... How did I end up not on zoom? Okay. Oops. My bad. Do this again. <laughs> if you don't use a tablet, it'll look something like this. And for whatever reason, it's black now. Yeah, make sure you put it on white. Yeah. If you don't, if you don't use a tablet, you just have to be really thorough, I guess. I mean, it depends on how you want it to look. In my case, I like mine to look like this. If you use a mouse, it might be easier. I don't know what kind of thing you use to do it. I don't know if you even have a tablet. So, I mean, that could come in handy. Not that they don't buy a tablet if you can do outlines and just, you know, just talking about stuff. And then you go blah, 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 blah. And, well, I'll just do one side because you kind of get the point. And then if you want to, now, I should have looked through this before I did this, well, you, can, you can smudge it. Oops. Well, merge it down first, so you kind of smudge everything at once, not just the lines you made. So you go, well, that's really high. Um, you don't want it to be too loud, otherwise yeah, it'll just look silly. So 12, because Madison said 12 ones in a tutorial, and I just kind of used it all the time. It's almost, it's 
stop by that, does it? I'm just gonna do da da da. It looks really, it's still, it, it's, it doesn't matter what that until you what you, do what you think looks good. This thing does not like my tablet very much now. And it's not, no, let's make it bigger. <laughs> smudge! I'll beat you. And then you smudge. And then everything's happy. And then you zoom out to see what it looks like. You could zoom out before too, just so you don't go, hmm, this is not what I expected at all. See? There you go. Um. Before. After. <laughs> before, after, before, after. So, hopefully that was, um, helpful at least a little bit. Um, I think that was all you asked. Um. Yeah, so, uh, uh recap. Brush size, small as you can get it. I used like three point, uh, point zero four, point zero three, point zero two, point zero one, and the fuzzy brush. It has to be fuzzy. It, I don't think it matters which one though. Just pick one and just mess with it. Color. Um, color has to be white. I mean, it could be any other color, but I use white. Texture. However you want it to look, I mean, make sure it moves in the right direction. If the fur is moving away from the face, then make sure you're using, making it move in that same direction. Like when you're smudging, you don't smudge in the opposite direction of the fur. Um, I guess that's it. So, just hopefully that was helpful. And, yep. <laughs>